What's up everyone, I'm James Riddler, and today we are going to be playing a demo, Deadly Broadcast, it's for an upcoming horror game on Steam, I will leave all the information in the description below, but pretty much it's where you are broadcasting, or live streaming, I'm assuming from a, a phone or camera, and you're in a, I think, abandoned hospital, and trying to discover ghost or something and you can actually play this game cooperatively um, and I'm uh, the way I, I went to the settings it was saying you can broadcast so I'm uh, assuming you can actually like have legit live streaming in this game too so that's kind of different but so we got different characters you can play as. So we got Emily the beauty blogger, 1.5 million. George the bodybuilder, 862,000 followers. The gamer, Roberto, 400k. Dave the technologist, 629k. So let's go with the gamer since we are a gamer. Um, Robert shoots gameplay videos of the latest horror, action, and adventure games on his channel and broadcasts live in the evenings. He is a retired esports player, a successful captain who has carried his team to the finals twice. So, yeah, let's try him out. Welcome to Deadly Broadcast, guys. Tonight. We are going to explore the mysterious abandoned mental hospital located outside the city. According to rumors, this was not just a simple hospital, but a place where various experiments were carried out on patients. Suddenly one night, for some unknown reason, it was as if all the patients were under the influence of an evil force and slaughtered all the guards. And since then, this cursed place has become a place no one visits. But we are here and get ready for the excitement. Cause deadly broadcast is starting. I'm assuming all those dings are notifications, cause like they're doing like a, in, or like a fake, live stream. So you got like fake people following or commenting. Is that it? Or is there more to the cutscene? We'll go ahead and skip it. Alright, so... Wow, we got a lot of people following us right now. And we got a... Donation, too. But, I've been seeing this quite a bit lately. People are, um... Dead doors jammed. Do we have a flashlight? Ah, okay, there we go. But I've been seeing a lot of games lately on YouTube and stuff implementing this type of thing. Which makes sense. I mean, figure that's what everyone's doing nowadays anyways is streaming. Alright, so... Oh, okay, so we just gotta remove. I couldn't see that because the flashlight was off. So we need to find a key. What's this on the floor? Um, I'm professional Dr. Smallwood. I'm leaving this note for our intruders. As soon as you step into the land, are, you are now a test subject. Okay. Ah, here we go. It's a little hard to see with the flashlight, though. There we go. Okay. 
Okay, so we need to go to the basement. It's like these memories don't belong to me. My memories started to blur. I have dreams that are not mine and sympathize with those who do not belong to me. It has become very difficult for me to even write something now. There's a lot of notes on the ground. My body started to get lighter. I feel strong and invincible. I feel as there are paper walls between myself and freedom. By the way, if you notice my um, face cam avatar is freaking out, that's because I accidentally moved my camera and now it's not like directly on my face. My bad feeling toward the manager started to disappear on the contrary I'm starting to like him now this feeling of invincibility to simply amazing even though oh I can hardly remember who I was before my thing is you know you imagine actually doing a broadcast like this I just keep thinking, it's like, would anyone really think it's real what's happening? What must have come to an end? Sometimes I think what I witnessed was a dream, nothing is normal. Someone should put an end to this. This is a madhouse, don't embarrass anyone. This is a huge laboratory for metaphysical experiments. This guy is pretty popular, I mean. I mean, well, 4NK, but, okay, I just made, like, a complete circle. Okay. So, okay, we got the laboratory. There's more nodes. Treatment we apply here has nothing to do with schizophrenia. Or multiple personality disorder. After all, the patients are not sick either. They are just abandoned. Today is the second day of my being taken to the dark room. This burning injection of my body is making my me lose my sanity even more. That scumbag manager is obsessed with me. He's doing everything he can to keep me out. Here we go. Now we're getting to the basement. Okay. That is like super hard. Flashlights and that is. What is this? Uh, find the pentagram. Are we piecing the pentagram together? What the crap? Okay, that's different. It would really be nice to have a brighter flashlight. You know, it's like, you know, it's 2022. I would think flashlights would be a little bit better. And that's something I mention in almost every horror game I play now. Is like, you think that you know, if you're using your cell phone or any kind of flashlight, you would think would be pretty bright nowadays. Okay, now what? summoning something what why did I think it was oh my gosh but I think this was a good idea of putting the pentagram together what the frick is happening right now my 
supposed to walk, be walking here? What in the world? Am I supposed to drop from here? Okay. something together. And I'm not streaming anymore. That's weird. Oh crap. Is there a jump? Okay, there is a jump. I thought I almost killed myself. actually play with, with up to four people. Did I read this? I enjoyed the Reg's first dose today. I can't get over the look he gave me when he woke up. Desire to kill gave me goosebumps in my little Rachel. His eyes I can't bear to look into. Looking at you is no longer as joyful as it used to be. Is a door? Oh, of course it is. Yeah, see that. I think that's what a lot of people would probably think. Like nowadays, like the stream is fake. Um, oh, there is a sprint. Okay. All these doors are locked. What does that say? Cannot read that. Right now I'm just trying to get out of the freaking basement. All the doors are locked. Don't get damaged. Huh? stupid basement. Another note. Can 
understand what's going on. My skin started to fade. My sense of hunger leaves this place. It deserves that I cannot understand. Something must have gone wrong during my treatment. How do I get out of here? I keep seeing turn off flashlight. Why would I turn off the flashlight? I cannot freaking find my way to get out of this stupid basement. I'm just... What keeps freaking making the gosh dang noise? So I feel like they need to have something here to like chase you maybe or something. I don't know. I'm just like either kill me or 
let me out, because... It was a... Wait, what? Huh? What was that? What's the axe for? I gotta end this because I don't know what what the frick I'm doing wrong here. I'm so lost. Now I don't know if there's okay, so I can't do that in a, in a game or in a, the demo. But I'm gonna end it, end the video there. Game looks promising. Um, I know I got lost at the end there. Um, but yeah, let 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 me know what you guys think of the game. Um, I think it has potential. I think it'd be pretty fun um, doing it with some friends. Um, maybe it'd be kind of like a phasmophobia type of game. But yeah, other than that, thank you everyone for watching. That was Deadly Broadcast, the demo, and I'll catch you in the next video.